echo the away. You want an annie, I go about the letter G. Uru and Anoni, I see you say in the door. A door, a pamakin, it's a finetto, a tiguac and a romance. And what I know. Yeah, my name is Orobo Sagod Meneyamu, uh, with the stage name Orobles. Tell us about your music. Yeah, just like a lot of artists all over the world, I started my music from the church choir in 1993. Then in 1999, I started playing the piano, still the church choir. Then in 2001, a friend invited me to join his father's band to be playing the piano in the band. And uh, right there, I we went for a show, and I saw a female playing the bass guitar and the back, you know, doing backup on stage. 
So I was really inspired and motivated. So I started learning how to play the, the bass, guitar, and the lead guitar too. And uh, in the after that, I started performing too on stage, and it was really exciting. Then in 2003, my friends and I we formed our own band, the Ambitious Brothers Band. And we did a lot of musical shows, performance, you know. Then in 2008, got my love for music too, I had to attend a one-year course, you know, in music, then in Benin City. And uh, in 2011, I started going to my friend's place, a friend of mine, you know, one of my mentor, Tayo, to decide the more Tayo, and uh, he had his own you know, recording studio. So I was always going to the studio, and uh, while going there, I developed you know, interest in you know, music production. And in 2013, I had to travel to South Africa, Cape Town, besides, to go and study music production. And uh, when I came back from South Africa, I was still going to my friend's studio, you know, working with him. And when he left Nigeria in 2015, I had to set up my own recording studio. And uh, over the years, I've been producing my songs and also for other artists too. And uh, also, the name uh, Oroblaze, you know, came to limelight. You know, actually, my pastor then initiated that name. You know, he just came one day, I could tell it was like, ah, all blessed, you know. And uh, that name just became something I just cherished. So that's what gave birth to the name, all of this. Okay, how long have you been in the game and how is it going? Yeah, well, uh, officially, I can say from 2010, that was when the music really started. That was 18 years ago for my music, my music performance and uh, for the production. I can say seven years plus now, from the time I finished from my music production school in South Africa. And uh, yeah, it's going fine, but uh, every good thing has its own challenges, especially when it comes to music equipment, for the studio, like you need a lot of studio equipment to be able to like produce good music and uh, the musical instruments. And the uh, most challenging is uh, when it comes to music promotion, you know, that requires, that has its own big challenges. But we are still pushing. What are you working on now and where do you intend to be the next five years? Uh, I've dropped two singles. I do a Siago and a Echo Diagway. So right now I'm trying to work on an EP. EP, a steady play, of about four or five tracks. And uh, I tend to feature some well known artists here in Benin, you know, in the EP. Uh, so far, in the next five years, I want to see myself dominating the music scene here in the city of those states, in Nigeria, in Africa, and even the world. So I, I, I want to take my music far, you know, to reach out to a large audience. What are your music angles? Uh, for Facebook, Oroblaze. For YouTube, Oroblaze. Instagram, Oroblaze. Then even for SoundCloud, Oroblaze. And uh, for Twitter, it's Oroblaze. What advice do you have for fellow musicians and artists like you, including your fans? Uh, for my fellow musicians and artists like me, uh, like you say, Rome was not built in a day. Yeah. So if this is what their mind tells them, if, if, if this is their passion, they should keep doing this. Despite all the challenges, they should not give up. They should keep doing their best. Also, look for people to like, mentor them and uh, it's not just jumping on the mic and singing, but also try to be in the midst of people in the, you know, in the game. Learn from them, also pay attention to, to what is happening and uh, be inspired to just keep pushing. And my fans, they should always support us by sharing our videos, our you know, music online with our friends and families. And in that way, they are also helping us to, to grow in the industry. This is still a real place. You can also stream his songs on Audiomark and watch his videos on YouTube. Thank you once again. Yeah, it's been a pleasure. No, not that way. Never it. Oh,